One way to improve our website is to make sure the text has suitable margins between it and the side box and the navigation at the top. Also that it doesn't run into the scroll bar at the side of the page. We're going to add a margin right and a margin left to move our text. We'll also find a suitable image to work as a background. I'm going to start by looking for an image. I'm going to look for a kitten for my pet shop in Google Images. It will also help to choose an appropriate size and possibly even have an animated image as an animated GIF. So switch on tools, look at size and perhaps choose medium so that you get a small image for downloading. You could also look for animated, although this is a choice that should not be made lightly. Find an image that you think would look good for your background. Something that will not interfere too much with the text. This has a very dark section and then light sections, and this makes a poor choice for a background image. This image fits in with my overall green colour scheme. So I click on the image, click on view image to make sure that I have a full sized version. And then right click and save picture as. This should be saved into the same folder as your main website. Notice flying percent 20 kitten has been caused by a space in the file name and it is better to have a sensible name with no spaces. I'm using an underscore here, flying underscore kitten JPEG. I'm going to switch back to expressions now. Go to new style. and add a style for the article tag. In this, I want to make sure that my box has a top margin to move it away from the navigation of perhaps 20 pixels, a right margin to move it away from the scroll bar of about 20 pixels, and a left margin that's wide enough to clear the aside bar. So I'm going to use about 180 pixels. If I click on apply, and we can see that we haven't quite moved out far enough from the aside bar here. So I'll change that to 250. And this is enough to clear that bar. I'm also going to go to background and choose a background image. So if I browse and choose flying kitten, and I want to set the X background size to 100% and the Y background size to 100%. Percent. Apply and OK. We should preview this in the browser to see how it looks. And you can see that although I have a background image, it is quite strong and it's difficult to read the text against it. In the next section, we will add some specific code that fixes this problem.